a high-fat, low-carbohydrate diet known as the ketogenic diet has gained popularity recently, inducing a metabolic state known as ketosis, in which the body burns fat for fuel rather than carbs, is the aim of the diet. Notwithstanding the controversy surrounding the diet, many users claim that going on a ketogenic diet has had substantial positive effects on their health. Here are 10 tips for following a ketogenic diet that can help you live a healthier life. Before we begin, please like and subscribe to our channel. 10. Focus on healthy fats. It's crucial to eat healthy fats when on a ketogenic diet. For those who follow a ketogenic diet, a focus on good fats is crucial. Since fat serves as the body's main fuel source, picking the proper kinds of fats is crucial for maximizing health advantages. Avocados, almonds, seeds, fatty fish, olive oil, and coconut oil are a few examples of good fats. These fats have important elements, including fiber, vitamins, and omega-3 fatty acids that can lower inflammation, strengthen the heart, and give the body energy. Trans fats, on the other hand, should be avoided because they raise the risk of heart disease and other illnesses. You can make sure that your body is obtaining the resources it needs to perform at its best while staying in a state of ketosis by include healthy fats in your diet. 9. Eat plenty of non-starchy vegetables. An essential part of a good ketogenic diet is consuming lots of non-starchy vegetables. Non-starchy veggies are a helpful supplement to any meal since they are low in carbohydrates and high in fiber, vitamins, and minerals. Great choices include cruciferous veggies like broccoli and cauliflower, leafy greens like spinach and kale, as well as other vegetables like bell peppers, succini, and asparagus. These vegetables are brimming with vital vitamins and nutrients including folate, vitamin C, and K that can support optimum health. In addition to giving you the nutrients, you need to maintain your body's functioning. Including these vegetables in your meals can help you stay within the ketogenic diet's carbohydrate restrictions. Consequently, it makes sense for those living a ketogenic lifestyle to include a lot of non-starchy veggies in their diet. 8. Limit your protein intake. While a necessary food, too much protein can actually cause you to exit the ketosis state. The ketogenic diet requires a strict restriction on protein intake. An excessive protein intake might cause gluconeogenesis, a metabolic process that turns protein into glucose, which can reduce ketone synthesis and obstruct weight reduction. Calculating the appropriate protein intake based on body weight and degree of activity is crucial to preventing this. A ketogenic diet calls for 0.6 to 0.8 grams of protein per pound of body weight per day. It's crucial to choose high-quality protein sources like wild-caught fish, free-range chicken, and grass-fed cattle. In comparison to traditionally reared meats, these sources are lower in harmful fats and higher in important nutrients. You may maintain ketosis and maximize the health advantages of the ketogenic diet, such as weight loss and improved blood sugar control, by limiting your protein intake and choosing high-quality sources. 7. Avoid sugar and refined carbohydrates. A proper ketogenic diet must exclude sugar and refined carbs. These items are quickly converted to glucose and can result in a fast rise in blood sugar levels, which can reduce ketone generation and perhaps cause you to exit ketosis. White bread, pasta, and baked goods are examples of refined carbs that are bad choices for people following a ketogenic diet since they are high in calories but low in nutrients. It is preferable to concentrate on complex carbs, which are rich in fiber and important nutrients, such as vegetables, nuts, and seeds. It's crucial to stay away from sugar and artificial sweeteners when it comes to sweeteners because they might boost blood sugar levels and reduce the advantages of a ketogenic diet. Use natural sweeteners instead, which don't affect blood sugar levels, including erythritol, monk fruit, or stevia. 6. Stay hydrated. Maintaining maximum health while on a ketogenic diet requires staying hydrated. When the body generates less insulin when it is in ketosis, the kidneys may excrete too much water and electrolytes, which can induce dehydration. It's crucial to consume a lot of water during the day to prevent this. Drinking 8 8-ounce glasses of water a day is the standard recommendation, 
Although depending on activity level, climate, and general health, each person's needs may differ. Electrolytes, including sodium, potassium, and magnesium, must be replaced because they are essential for adequate hydration and muscle performance. Some hydrating beverages, such as herbal tea and bone broth, can be helpful in addition to water. Avoid sugar-rich beverages, like soda and fruit juice, as these might boost blood sugar levels and counteract the ketogenic diet's advantages. 5. Use coconut oil for cooking. Coconut oil is an excellent source of good fats and can withstand high cooking temperatures without degrading. Due to its high concentration of medium-chain triglycerides, which the liver easily converts into ketones and can serve as a rapid source of energy, coconut oil is a preferred option for those who follow a ketogenic diet. Coconut oil is a great option for frying, baking, and cooking because it is stable at high temperatures. Coconut oil is resistant to heat damage and does not form harmful free radicals, in contrast to other oils that can become rancid and oxidized at high temperatures. The best virgin coconut oil for cooking is unrefined, premium quality, lightly processed, and preserves all of the nutritional value and flavor of the original coconut. 4. Get enough electrolytes. The body excretes more electrolytes, like salt and potassium, when on a ketogenic diet. Consume foods high in electrolytes, including leafy greens and avocados, to ensure you're getting enough of these crucial nutrients. For a ketogenic diet to work, getting enough electrolytes is crucial to maintaining good health. When the body is in ketosis, less insulin is produced, which might cause the kidneys to flush too much water and electrolytes and cause an imbalance. Minerals called electrolytes are necessary for healthy neuron, muscle, and hydration function. Magnesium, potassium, and sodium make up the three primary electrolytes. Even though these minerals are present in a wide variety of foods, a ketogenic diet can make it difficult to get enough of them because many high-carbohydrate foods that are high in electrolytes are forbidden. 3. Monitor your ketone levels. Following a ketogenic diet requires careful attention to your ketone levels. When the body is in a state of ketosis, which happens when carbohydrate intake is low and fat intake is high, the liver produces ketones. You may check your ketone levels in a number of ways, including with blood, urine, and breath tests. The most precise method involves measuring the amount of beta-hydroxybutyrate in the blood with a tiny gadget. Whereas breath tests assess the amount of acetone in the breath, urine tests use specific strips to test the amount of acetoacetate in the urine. Consider checking your ketone levels using pee strips or a blood glucose meter to be sure you're in ketosis. 2. Practice intermittent fasting. On a ketogenic diet, intermittent fasting can boost insulin sensitivity and quicken weight loss. Think about eating all of your calories in an 8-hour time frame and going 16 hours without eating. Those who use a ketogenic diet frequently practice intermittent fasting. In order to improve metabolic health and encourage weight loss, it entails alternating fasting and eating periods. The 16-8 method, which entails fasting for 16 hours a day and eating within an 8-hour window, and the 5-2 approach, which entails eating normally for 5 days a week but limiting calories to 500-600 to 600 for two separate, non-consecutive days, are two examples of the various types of intermittent fasting. 1. Work with a healthcare professional. It's crucial to speak with a healthcare provider before beginning a ketogenic diet to be sure it's secure and suitable for you. While there are numerous potential health and wellness advantages of the ketogenic diet, it's crucial to make sure you're following it safely and efficiently. A healthcare professional can offer advice on how to follow a ketogenic diet while maintaining a proper balance of macronutrients, fat, protein, and carbohydrates, and micronutrients, vitamins, and minerals as well as make suggestions for supplements or other dietary interventions to support your general health. A medical professional can also assist in keeping an eye out for any possible consequences or side effects of the diet, such as changes in blood cholesterol levels or stomach problems. Also, they can offer assistance and direction in modifying the diet to suit the requirements of people with particular medical problems or dietary limitations. That's a wrap for today's video. What are your thoughts on our list? Let us know in the comment section below.
and make sure to like and subscribe to our channel for more